The first order of operations problem that we're going to look at uses parentheses. In order to solve this problem, we're going to use the strategy of PEMDAS, which stands for parentheses, exponents, multiplication and division from left to right, and then addition and subtraction from left to right. The first operation that we're going to solve is inside of the parentheses, and 8 minus 6 is 2. We're going to write it directly underneath the parentheses, and then we're going to bring down all of the pieces of the problem that we haven't solved yet. The second operation that we're going to tackle is the exponent. 5 squared is 25, and we're going to bring the rest of the problem down again. Next, we're going to solve the multiplication problem, bring the remaining pieces down, and then our last operation to solve is addition with 25 plus 6, which is 31. The next grouping symbol we're going to use are brackets. These are placed outside of parentheses, and when we go to solve them, we actually start inside in the parentheses and we work our way out. So the first step of this problem is going to be to solve the 4 plus 3 in parentheses, which is 7, and bring down the rest of the problem. Because the parentheses have been solved, you can get rid of them and just bring down the answer within the brackets. Next, we solve the second symbol, which is the brackets, and 18 minus 7 is 11. And our final step is to bring down our multiplication problem and solve 11 times 5 for a final answer of 55. The third and final grouping symbol that we're going to look at is braces. We're going to work our way from the inside out with parentheses, and since there are two operations inside the parentheses, we're going to follow the order inside there and solve the exponent. Then we'll bring down the rest of the problem and solve the remaining operation inside the parentheses, which is 9 minus 5. We'll write our answer of 4 below it and then bring down the rest of the problem. Now that our parentheses are solved, we're going to work out to the next grouping symbol, which is brackets. 6 plus 4 is 10, and then we again bring down the rest of the problem. Since everything inside the brackets has been solved, the brackets disappear, and then we have our braces left. That's the last grouping symbol that we're going to solve. 10 plus 10 is 20, and then the final operation is multiplication, and 6 times 20 is 120.